Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Jacob Schiller. I'm the online gear editor at Outside Magazine. We're in our famous gear cage downstairs. Um, today we are talking about the Thule round trip ski bag. So this is new for next year. It'll be out next fall. But we got a sneak peek about a month ago and then they just sent us one. Ski bags, eh, pretty boring. They're pretty utilitarian. But I'm super excited about this one because Thule really nails the details. They sort of put a lot of thought into this thing uh, and made it a lot better than any other bag I've actually really used. So super excited. So I'll sort of walk you through some of the most important things. So it's got a nice size. I've got a pair of 190s in here that fit no problem. It's got nice ski straps so everything stays locked down. It's got a nice pole for the poles, which is nice. But what Thule did that was really smart was they took something that we all do, which is shoving puffies into our bags for extra storage. Like we all wanna throw extra clothes in there. So included in the bag are these lovely stuff sacks, which are essentially just big sleeping bag stuff sacks. But what they do is they have this pocket on the side that is meant to slip over the tip of the ski and then you just shove it in there. And what you have is a bag that's not only gonna protect your puffy, but you also are gonna have a ski protector that's gonna keep my two skis separated or protect my tips. So another nice thing about this bag is instead of a full zipper along one side, there's sort of an S zipper. So I'll show you, it comes off the top and then crosses down here to the middle and you have these two zippers. So what's the point? So say for example, I had you know a puffy buried at the bottom of my pack Instead of having to unzip my whole bag and have everything come popping out, I can just go from the middle, keep the rest of this zipped up, get in there, pull my puffy out. So it's like, it's not a huge deal, but it's a nice, again, sort of forward thinking design uh, on the part of Thule. The final thing they did is they've added some stiffness to the top of the bag. So I have a pair of 190s in here, it's not gonna be a problem, but if you had a pair of 160s in here that were down here and you were trying to carry it from up here, and then roll it, the top of the bag would want to just fold over. And then you'd have this floppy, hard to manage bag. But Thule, again, added some stiffness here. So even if you have a shorter pair of skis, the bag stays rigid, which makes it easier to carry. So overall, I'm just really impressed with the way that Thule slowed down. And instead of just trying to sort of read it, like make another ski bag that's like all the other ski bags, they thought about how we use the gear. So you're gonna have a non-torn puffy, you're gonna have intact skis, and it's gonna be easy to carry regardless how big your skis are.